video. I am sorry, Moose, and today is another Skyblock video. But I haven't played Skyblock, uh, especially on this profile, in like a week. So, nothing's really changed since Skyblock 4, which I know was very not very long ago, but the recording was a while ago. But I just collected my minions, but instead of selling them to Bazaar, like I was just about to, we are going to put them in our e-chest. And... So that we can save for upgrades. And sheesh, my Minecraft sound is loud. Um, okay, we were a little bit laggy. As you can see, I did claim my flying pig. Uh, not very useful, but okay. Wait, why are there two pages of coal? That's messed up. Oh wait, there weren't, but we're just gonna do this because we don't need the third page, and then this can be an actual e-chest page. Just gonna put the flying pig in there in case we ever do get a pig. But if we come over here, and we look at Mayor Jerry, you can see that Atrax is winning, but if we look at Mayor Jerry, we can see that his perk is Jerry Apocalypse, which basically means that it reveals hidden Jerry's, and there's four rarities of them. And if you get one, they drop a gu guaranteed Jerry box. And as you can see, the Jerry boxes, ooh, they're worth coin like if we get a golden oh my gosh that'll be so good even if we only get like three greens that's still so many coins at this stage so i've heard that the best way to do it is by farming we don't have any farms on our island so we're just gonna farm wheat i'm just gonna come over here and get a private hub yeah but we can sell the rest of our inventory to bazaar you know, get those coins, get those coins, yeah. Okay. So we made just about 100 coins from that. So now we just grind wheat, and after a little bit, we'll get a Jerry. And then there will be a six minute cooldown before the next Jerry. So, yeah, let's just do that. So, we're just gonna punch wheat in the hub with our rookie hub. And, yeah. Okay. For a second I, there, I thought that the default texture was a wooden hull, which weird. Which would have meant that my texture pack's messed up. It wouldn't be the first time that that's happened with this pack, which is Bumblebee16x by the way, yeah, releasing at 50 subs, you should definitely go check it out when it releases, or if you're watching this after it releases, but yeah, kind of messed up my sales pitch there, I meant to say you should definitely go subscribe so we get there faster. But yeah, ooh, farming eight. That was six hundred coins. Nice, nice. But yeah. So I'm gonna see you when we get our first Jerry. Hello everyone, we are back. We've been going for about ten minutes now. And as we scroll through our chat here, we haven't gotten a single Jerry. It's crazy. But if you look at my uh, purse in the uh, you know right right corner, you'll see that uh, we might we might have made a we might have made a little bit from that was just from farming. So yeah, but we're going to check on some things in the auction house and see what we can buy. So we still need a. Uh, Griffin pet and a silver fang as our weapon. 
So if we check here, Griffin Pat lowest common is about 54. And the lowest silver thing is about 9.4. Wait, let's look if there's one that has a reforge for just a little bit more. Oh wow, they're all from the same guy. Okay, so this one we get four of them, so we could flip that, but I don't know who's buying them. Besides me. Okay, these are just stacks of them. Okay, so yeah, there are not enough enchants or reforges, but that's okay. Because we're going to have some coins left over. And if we just come over here to this guy, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we just click on this guy, we can. Here? Oh, no, we went sharp, duh. Heroic, odd, odd, sharp. So, as you can see here, we got our sharp silver thing. Impressive, right? And we can do a damage test. So, let's head over to the gold mine, slap telekinesis on this baby, and do a damage test. Uh, right over here. between the two. Now, this does have an ability, a hundred more damage to undead mobs. And we are going to be doing the test on undead mobs, because that's like the majority of the game at this stage. So, yeah. Slap telekinesis. And then let's go back to the hub and let's just do it on the graveyard zombies, because we do have like 12k on us. And while if you, any of you are in-game players, that seems like dirt. It seems like dirt to me on my old profile, on my other profile. But on this profile, to us, 12k is like basically half of our net worth. So yeah. Let's just put this stuff away. And then this little baby is the other half of our net worth. But anyways, let's see. So we're going to do this, and then we're going to do this. Okay, get the rogue sword for that, that precious 60 more speed or whatever. Um, it's 40 more speed. Okay, so we're going to start off with this. It's an epic sword. So it is a little bit unfair, but I don't really care because I already know the answer. Okay, as you can see here, we're doing crazy amounts more. We're doing over a hundred, we're doing about 130 more damage. And it's uncommon, which makes the reforges better. But there actually is an ability that I want to try. Yeah, I don't know if that was me actually. But as you can see, this does a hundred more damage to these guys. So if we just sword swap, basically whenever we hit the uh, silver fang, it should, okay, we're not critting? Is that what's happening? Yeah, I think that that's what's happening, huh? Maybe I'm doing it backwards. I'm not, oh, I think I pulled it off there. I'm not very used to this whole sword swap thing. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to go silver fang to epic. Undead sword. So I think that we will reforge just to sharp just for our sword swaps on these guys, even though we barely will need it on anyone. But you know, flex. I know. Flex, but at this stage in the game, I mean, my profile is a week old, but my playtime is not much at all. And considering we can one tap lapis zombies without any enchants on this is really good. I never knew how good punching wheat in the hub could be. Because that made us so much money in a really short amount of time. Because it made us 20k in 10 minutes. So, yeah. And we're going to look at some armor. We're going to want to start getting into armor for when we progress to the end. Once we hit combat level 12. No, we like you on that reforge. Reforge, legendary, odd, uh, sharp, I just want to see, oh, that's an actual feature, that's kind of cool, Hypixel added that in as an actual feature, because I'm on my PvP profile, and that doesn't have SBA, so that's fascinating, I never knew that they would do that, 
Because for those of you that need context, everyone, um, basically that, basically that's a feature in SBA, but with their new changes, um, that was disallowed in SBA, but now it's, uh, just part of regular skyblocks, that's always nice. So as you can see there, we're doing 130 with no reforge on our armor, no crit. So that's really good, but if we sword swap Silver Fang to Undead Sword, we're doing 261 non-crit. Almost 500 damage on a crit. Oh, I bu butchered my sword swaps there. But once we get Reforge on this armor, actually, I might go look at a, a good armor called Mushroom Armor. If I can walk. I, I just want to see if there's any of it on the auction house because we don't have the collection. I really don't want to grind mushrooms. <laughs> uh, let's see. Mushroom. Uh, arm. If we go to auctions. Ending soon. There's a piece of dyed mushroom. Ouch. 16 coins. Okay, I'll bid. Uh, 2k. It's way overpaid, but I don't really care because I really want this armor. Basically, your stats are tripled during the night. The stats from the armor? Okay, I'll bet it on the oh, it's in five hours. Yeah, that's not happening. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm just going to place a bit of 5k, and that's as high as I'm going. And we don't get our coins back. But I am going to slap a reforge on this armor because, well, how much is Harden Diamond? Hardened. Ooh. Ben lowest. 2.5 mil. What? Uh, oh, that's highest. Okay. 10k. Okay, we're not gonna slap a reforge on this. And it's reinforced. Okay, so as you can see, we just got hardened diamond, which is pretty good. Um, let's see, we already bought boots. Ooh, I'll, I'll take it. Oh, we don't have enough money for it? Sad. And I bet we don't have enough money to reforge either. Ooh, I can't believe we don't even have a wardrobe. Okay. And we'll have a little bit to slap a reforge on some of this. Smart. Um, we're just gonna go for anything, honestly. Fierce? We will take that. We're looking for pure fierce. Mythic, we'll take that. Fierce, we'll take it. Mythic, we'll take it. Because we don't have enough money anyways. So, yeah. And, um, in the however long it is when, when that mushroom armor piece ends, we will get our coins back. So we can reforge and buy and all that. But I think I'm going to keep it like this. Because this adds a good mix of health and defense for the coins I paid. Anyways, if we don't butch... Show me damage, please. Okay. With just the silver fang, we're doing 325 damage. Which, that's really good. Considering I played like 3 hours on this profile. Probably a little way less. Okay, yeah, 325, and let's check our crit chance. As you can see, our crit chance is, crit chance is 60. So that's 6 out of 10, so that's not very bad. Um, if we go over and do our sword swap, we're doing 650 damage with our sword swap. Let's just put this over here. And then we can sell this piece to, um, a NPC because we won't need it anymore. Let's just head right over here. Sell it to this guy. Okay, sold all that. And let's see, can we buy any talismans? 500... Yeah, uh, wait, we can't buy 500. Let's do this one. Let's go slap a reforge on it. That'll be nice. 
I wonder if the shrine's ever going to go down. And uh, yoink. Pretty. Eh, health and intelligence. We have to take it so we are. Um, we can't put that in our accessory badges yet because we don't have one. Oh my. Um, so we need to get some. So I'm going to go get some redstone for accessory bag upgrades. So, yeah, until this auction ends. Two minutes? Okay, I got two minutes to do this. Wait, so I should visit Portal Hub? We can do this. Oh, right. How sad. Um, yeah. This island's a little bit... Oh, well, it's okay. And we will be needing to get our enchanting level up. That's actually probably what I'm going to buy with some when we get the money back. I'm going to buy some grand XP bottles to enchant. Um, when am I going to enchant? Because we don't really need enchants on our silver. Yeah, yeah, we will. Need enchants on our silver thing. Because although the, uh, this is, well, yeah, there's no point not to. I was just thinking we could enchant our armor, but we're going to have a reinforced, or hardened soon, so. The fact that this came on reinforced is pretty lucky, because reinforced is semi-rare. So. Yep. Oh. Uh. When you take fire and sky block, that's how you know your early game. Uh, you, you, and we're gonna mine some redstone and try not to anger any pigmen. Ah, uh, yes, yes. We're gonna punch the pigmen for fun. Cause I live for danger. No, that's because our pickaxe can't mine redstone, which is really, really sad. Actually, I think I'm going to get efficiency on my pick. Oh. Uh oh, uh oh, big uh oh. I was never here, I never, I didn't kill like four of you guys. Okay. So we're gonna go over here, talk to the guy who will give us some diamonds, which is bizarre. Now that I'm using my brain. Come over to here. Okay. Some of this. Some of this. Do some of this. Do some of this. Do some of this. Get our diamond pickaxe. Get rid of some of you. Then we can go over here and talk to the librarian. I'm pretty sure that he can sell us a... What should we call it? Um, enchanting table, of course. So, you, please just give me the stupid table. Um, he doesn't. That is sad. But I do believe that the builder might. If not, we can just buy obsidian and diamonds and books and do it ourselves. Yeah! <sighs> okay, uh, here, no, no. Nope. Nah. Nope, okay, yeah. If I missed it, which is most likely the case. Um, and then we need, ooh, just enough coins. A diamond. I don't know any NPCs that sell it besides this guy. Which is really just players selling it. Wait, it's two diamonds, isn't it? I know Minecraft. One book. And then we'll need a bunch of bookshelves, but yeah. There's probably an NPC that I can buy this from. Wait, can we get efficiency 5 using this? Hey, we can. 30 XP levels? 
Ricky can I buy a oh wait I need to buy a book I'm getting so distracted uh, oh 20 coins I do not have that kind of money what do you think I am rich I guess we can sell a few of our minion items too bizarre to make money or NPC that, so that we don't accidentally sell it to sell our other materials for making you know ooh 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 wow that made a lot of coins wait I bet our auction ended it's probably been two minutes I don't care claim coins okay there we go now we got some coin yeah, I don't really want to see the items currently being sold. I did, but then... Oh, wait, we need another obsidian. Okay. Whew. Referee arm, we're looking good. Um, come over here. By you. There's none of that, okay. Okay, now we can craft one. Okay, we got our enchanting table, and we can place it down. If we take this, and then wait, wait, the rest of our island is made out of this. So let's take one of these. Okay, four stacks is a little excessive, and then if we just bridge out to here, and then let's see, one, two, three. How do we want to do this? We'll probably need to make a platform like this. Huh. How do I want to do this? I think I know. And then like this. Okay, um, I definitely knew what I was doing from the start, no doubt. Okay, so if I place it down here, then I would need to dig this up. Okay, I got my idea now. Might have been a little bit, but that's okay, we can make it work. Okay, so we're just gonna dig this bridge out. Uh, go over to here. Nice. Okay, and then the bookshelves. We'll go here, 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 here. Okay, yeah. I did it, yay, hi. Okay, so if we go make or get bookshelves, I wonder where we can buy those. I bet the builder has them, he's got everything. What just happened? What are these explosions? Oh, this is a long recording session. Uh, bookshelves. No? Oh, wait, it'd be in here. Bookshelves, yay! I think we need 30. Oh, ooh, that was expensive. Oh, my. That was expensive. Okay. Hey, I was right, you do need 30. But there's our enchanting table, we got two extra bookshelves that we can go and sell. And we just need XP! Which, luckily, you can buy experience. Remember how, when we actually had money? Sheesh, imagine. Oh, that's expensive. We can come over here and just buy some bottle XP. Bundle the. 
pocket. Okay, just over here, splash it. And just get to 30. Maybe. Or not. So, let's see. Our 20 should do it, I think, maybe. Oh, way too much, but okay. And we can just use this one. Efficiency 5. Okay, so we just hit enchanting 3, which is good. Because as soon as we can hit enchanting 10, we can start to use the uh, experimentation table and get, like, good stuff. Nice. Oh, this guy's got a Jerry. So that's what it looks like. Basically, it gives you a message in chat, and then it has one of these. And you need to catch up to it, kill it. And this one will give a blue Jerry box. Which, if we come over to the bazaar, we can see that it is blue Jerry. It is uh, about 200k, but I wouldn't sell them now. I would wait. <laughs> until the event is over like a month after and you can make tons of profit we're going to be selling it now purely because we need the coins now but i think that that's going to do it for this episode we tried to get a jerry but just couldn't manage it but thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the